Hello, my name is Ian Crawford and I am a DIY promoter in Glasgow. I've been doing DIY music for about 20 years since uh, my band was around and um, I would uh, make posters, make uh, demo covers for CDs, uh, put the posters up around the town, book the venue, book our bands to play by the writer, put the gig on, take the money at the door, pay everyone at the end of the gig and hopefully have a little bit of money left over. Um, not often, but that doesn't matter because DIY, do it yourself, the community is a great way to start in music. Um, you don't have to wait for someone to ask you to play a gig. You don't have to wait for someone to give you a record deal. You just do it yourself. And it's any kind of music. Music can be folk, punk, rock, electronic, other kinds of music that's out there. If you're doing it yourself, that's the whole point. Uh, back when I started doing it, um, it was a case of taking an image I'd found in a book, going to my college and photocopying it, cutting it out, printing out stuff, making it you know, very DIY as you can imagine it in the, what you can see in zines and the punk kind of world. Uh, now DIY um, can be anything because of the time has moved on. Um, the production quality is better on, on um, computers and recording techniques are better. Um, but essentially, if it's for promotion of gigs, that hasn't really changed. So um, look around your local area, try and find a venue or a space that hasn't been used for a while. Cricket clubs are good, bowling, um, bowling clubs are old, old bars that maybe don't, you know, have much of a crowd. Just uh, rock up, approach these people, Ask them if they would like to have something happen, and generally they do because they need uh, they need young people in doing things. And again, DIY music isn't just for young people because I'm now in my early forties and I'm still doing it. I run a festival called Freakender with a couple of friends, and we started that because there was a gap for kind of garage rock and roll music in Glasgow that we felt uh, wasn't being filled. So. Um, we have been doing the festival for five years now and we do gigs all throughout the year and we do it ourselves. We book the bands, we book bands from America, Australia, UK wide, Glasgow local based bands and we put them together in various venues and we just do that thing. We sell tickets, we buy the rider, our costs are really low and we just try and make it happen so uh, we could go on talk about this for ages, but go do it. Just, there's nothing stopping you. DIY, keep it going. Uh, thanks for listening and bye.